Your relationship with your food delivery driver is getting a bit too close for comfort. Maybe it's time to cut ties. I'm gonna teach you how to make a quick and easy beef stir fry that we're gonna do all in one skillet. I love stir fries because they're quick and simple. The name of the game is high heat, a little oil, and a whole lot of stirring. The key to stir fry is making sure you have all your ingredients ready to go. This is gonna cook so fast, you're not gonna have time to find the ingredients once you start cooking. So we're gonna start by putting our steak in the freezer for about 10 minutes. Now while that's chilling, we're gonna gather up our veggies. You could buy pre-cut broccoli florets, but it's much more affordable to buy an entire broccoli crown and cut it up yourself. Hold it upside down like this, and we're gonna cut around the middle. So you might end up with some big old trees like this. We want tiny little shrubs like this. So just break them apart or cut them up like so. And I wanna throw it in with the rest of my veggies. Now my veggies are ready and you just saved a couple bucks. So I'm gonna pull that steak out the freezer right now. Freezing the steak like what we just did, it'll make it more firm and easier to cut. Now when we cut the steak, we want even thin strips. So we're cutting across the grain like this. You see right there where the grain is going across right there, we're gonna cut across it, which is gonna make it easier to chew. It's gonna keep it tender. And once I finish with cutting my meat, I'm gonna wash my hands. We don't wanna contaminate. Now, time for some flavor. We got some water here. We're gonna take some soy sauce, throw that right in there. And we're gonna use our McCormick one skillet seasoning mix. These are great because all the spices you need are ready to go right here in this little packet. So we're just gonna mix that up a bit. Whisk that up. So from there, we're gonna add a little vegetable oil to our large non-stick skillet here. It's already on medium high heat. So once the oil starts to shimmer a bit in the pan, like that, we're good to go. So first, we're gonna add our steak right all in there. And remember, you wanna keep stirring this constantly, all right? It's only gonna take like three minutes to cook all these pieces. So we wanna keep this moving, keep it cooking, keep it sizzling. It's like exercise, you know? It's like keep it moving, you know? And looks like our steak's done. So I'm gonna take our meat out of the skillet. So I'm gonna add the rest of my oil. Pan's already hot. We're gonna throw our veggies right in there. And again, like I said, this is quick. We're not gonna overcook these. We're gonna just get them tender, keep them crispy. Maybe like four minutes in the pan. My mom said you have to have greenery on your plate. So I'm doing, I'm doing what she says because I'm terrified of her. Good boy. Mmm. All right. So once our veggies are done, we're gonna pour our sauce mixture right in there. Get it all over everything. We're gonna mix this up, bring it to a boil over the medium heat. The balance of these flavors is gonna come together. This is gonna taste so delicious. You know, also, I'm a Libra, so I'm all about balance. So we're ready to add our steak back into this flavor party going on in here. We wanna make sure this sauce thickens up nicely so we have a nice saucy coating all over everything. The veggies are nice and crisp. The meat's tender, not overdone. Sauce is thickened, it's coated all the vegetables nicely. Saucy. Now this dish is amazing to eat on its own, but you could also serve it up with some rice or some noodles, and just like that, you got an easy one skillet stir fry that will stir up some delicious feelings within you. Make sure to check out the Flavor Maker app you'll find all the Flavor Maker videos and tons of delicious recipes. You can even scan your McCormick spices, add them to your digital spice rack, and create shopping lists, plus a ton of other cool features that I haven't even explored yet. Have fun cooking, guys.